morning, I'm Kennedy Sanders. And I'm Cadence Graham. And we're gonna be your toy guides for this walk step. Can anybody tell me the difference between these two windows right here? This one seems like it might be a little smaller than that one at the end. You're correct. So, um, can anybody tell me why? I don't know, maybe it's like a cool architectural feature. Well, not exactly. It's because this building is parallel to Henderson Street and this building is parallel to Manor Street and those streets aren't perpendicular. So it makes it look uneven. Huh. And it gives it that unique style. Small, cool. As we turn around and look at this map, does anyone know why we like to show this map? Is it a map of Dallas? Yes. But it's related to math and science because this map is a model and models show things that are too small, too big, and far away. And we like to show this map because to know where we're at and to know no matter how far or close you are, you can still come to solo. Good morning, my name is Araceli Esquivel. Hi, my name is Atisha Roki, and we are gonna take you down the third and fourth grade hall. So we're gonna Okay, so look at that window with that with that building. Doesn't that building look really big? Yes. What do you think will happen when we get to the end of the hall? It'll look even bigger. Great, great hypothesis. Let's go find out. They feel that body that they turn on. Then when you walk out, they eventually turn off. Thank you for sharing your time with us. Thank you for teaching us so much. Thank you. Thank you. Good morning. My name is Torica Davis, and this is my partner, Alenka Hashem. And we're both scholars from Solar Prep. And today we'll be giving you a special walk STEM tour. And STEAM stands for Science, Technology, Engineering, Art, and Math. Welcome to the music room. How do you think the music stays in this room? Maybe like the carpet, does the carpet help with that to block out some of the noise? No, but these gray things up here are sound panels and they keep the music from staying in here so it won't travel across the building and it won't disrupt other people's learning. And on the count of three we could do a little experiment um, to see if the sound panels really work. One, One two, two, three, echo! And now in the robotics lab there is a lot more um, space and it's more like uh, very wide and tall. So we're, we're probably gonna be moving inside there and seeing what the differences are with sound panels and with no sound panels. So this is our robotics lab and now on the count of three we'll be uh, shouting and go to see what the differences are. So we, this is basically where your tour ends. We 
we thank you for giving us this opportunity to tour you and we hope you had an amazing time. Thank you. We love